Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I will show you how to detect devices using user agent library in Codec Nido. So let's get started. So I'm going to show you documentation first in which you can see it clearly states that it gives information about browser, mobile devices and robot using your site. And after that it uh, initializes the class that how you can include user agent library into your code and then after that you can use with this agent now there is example that i'm going to show you this example so in this example you can see there are several functions that will detect that it's a web browser it's a mobile device or it's a robot and after this there is class reference so you can go through this documentation if you want I have just shown you for reference so now I have created this view I have just given one heading information about devices so this library is by default present so now let's go and include this so copy this and I'm going to paste this into my index so here I'm loading my library that is user agent so first I'm going to show you is platform what platform gives us is basically which operating system you are using like window 10 it's Linux so for using this right this agent platform and save and let's go refresh so it's giving window 10 so you can also get Mac and Linux depending upon your operating system so next I'm going to show you is is browser or not so right so replace platform to is browser now let's go and refresh so you can see the result is one as I'm using a browser so after that let's go and check its version that which browser version I'm using so right version now save and let's go and refresh so you can see now it's giving us version of your browser and uh, let's say next let's check uh, for mobile as I'm not using any mobile right now so what output it will give so right is mobile save and refresh so you can see it's giving us a blank output so next I'm going to show you is browser which browser I'm using so write this agent browser save and now let's go to browser refresh so output is Chrome as I'm using Chrome browser so now let me just copy this complete example and now show you the output of this example so let's see what example is doing so first one is it's checking is browser or not if it's browser then show me browser and its version then check is robot and its robot then show me its detail after that is mobile and then show me the mobile details else undefined user agent and then print that agent and also print agent platform so now let's go and uh, refresh so there is one error so what error so I missed uh, something okay I forgot to close the bracket of class so just close the bracket and now let's go and refresh now so you can see it's giving Chrome and its version and last is platform so these three things it printing now let me show you the same thing on mobile screen so let me just refresh it you can see it's giving Chrome version and then Android Android it's a platform as Android is an operating system for mobile so next I'm going to show you is agent string you can see the example below as well so write this agent agent string and give a break in between so now let's go and refresh browser so you can see there is Mozilla window 10 then there is Apple WebKit at uh, last there is Chrome its version Safari is there so that's the agent user agent you will get so let me show you in mobile as well so first one you can see it's Mozilla then it's Linux then Android and it's giving model as well then Apple WebKit it's giving Chrome as I'm showing you in browser then you can see it's again giving mobile so that 
is user agent i'm showing you in mobile as i'm using chrome in mobile so using this information you can check is browser it's mobile or it's robot like if for example let's say you just want to log in in web only then you can check its browser or not and you can restrict that if it's mobile then redirect to login so in this video i have shown you how to use user agent library in coding nighter and how to detect devices using it i hope you really like this video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching